Stepping through with the real flow Signing out ES News Andy Emilio and why I'm gonna have good nights I'm have bad nights You know, one of those things Where I'm just getting back Into rotation And getting quality fights And Morris was a quality opponent Nobody wanted to fight him Dylan White didn't want to fight him And um, like I said before I have the hardest route To a heavyweight title right now Deontay Ford it's the Vern for the title who didn't even show up that night the first time. Mm -hmm. Ariola for a title shot. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So like I said, yo, it's crazy. AJ didn't fight nobody to get to a title shot. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So if you look at what my record is, I fought top ten can before I even get to a title shot now. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And I say it's all popular. Tough durable guys. Yeah, too. tough durable guys. You know what I'm saying? So like Eddie Hearn said, you gotta look great against Maurice Watt to get a title Man. shot. Of course, I already like I don't care what he says. Cause I know I'm gonna look the ultimate great against Maurice. Look, he's a tough, mm -hmm. tough guy. But the main thing is I gotta stop it earlier than everybody else. Yeah, I true. got the win. And uh hopefully I was just sloppy just enough. Enough, so AJ can call me out. So did Eddie give you any kind of? Was there a look? Was there something? Is there any word that he's like, okay, you're getting Dylan White, not AJ, or the inverse? Um, no, we didn't, I didn't talk to him directly um, about it yet. But I know I definitely seen him, and they wanted me to put the pressure on him a little more. But like I said before, I took my time when, when, when the time came and um, tried to pick up here and there. But like I said, that man's fighting. Some days you have good days, and they have bad days. But you still got the winning TK. Which big baby are we gonna see in the future? Is the 300 pound big baby coming back, or 284? Um, we'll like the where you want to yeah, stay? I, th I think. I think I'm going to gradually come down a little more and just tighten everything up, but I really want my strength back. I think we did no weight training, we did no push-ups for this fight, nothing because of my elbow. We did a lot of condition, a lot of pad, a lot of foot drills. I think I overtrained a little bit. Um, the movement and quickness wasn't there the way I wanted it to be. But like I said, it's boxing, it's trial and error. We're going to tweak a couple of things. We're going back to the fight, watch it, and see what we can fix. Um, HBO. Uh it seems like the only path you can have really is Joshua. Yeah. So, and how many more fights do we see that? Because, you know, Eddie was talking about you and Joshua in Brooklyn for his American debut. That's what he says, but, you know, promoters talk a lot of junk. You know? <laughs> so, I, I don't hold, I mean, once it's on paper and contract, then I take it serious. Right? Okay. But until then, the main thing is uh, just get back in the gym. You know what I mean? Work and tweak certain things. Just be ready for whatever comes my way. You know what I mean? Like I said, I feel good. He didn't hurt me or nothing. I actually hurt myself. Don't okay. shoot him, you know? But, uh, like I said. What exactly happened there? What is it, his shoulder? Um, or? No, no, it was my. Well, he broke his hand supposedly in the okay. head because a couple body shots to slow him down. But I actually hypersended my elbow going back. Mm. And he told me I have a growth spurt and uh, tonight that's in the elbow. And I didn't want to get an x ray on it before the fight. Mm. I kind of just went through with the cardio, cardio, cardio. So you have the bone spurs currently. That's yeah, like what yeah, Keith Thurman's going yeah, through. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm going to get it checked out probably this week and see how bad it is and whatever it is. But like I said, it's part of boxing. You know, every fight I'm going through something like, oh my God. Yeah. Like, you know, so it's part of the game, man. Like I said, I just suck it up and just, you know, continue to do what I do, man. Part I want to change the lanes to hip hop real quick. Call, yeah. Saw Uncle Murder bring you out. Yeah. Uh, how that connection happened? I know it's well, all Brooklyn, but um. Yeah, but anyway, um, you know, DJ Self was like my like my brother. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? So I know him when I just started like boxing years ago through one of my one of my mentors from the neighborhood named Big Just, and he put us in connection way back when. And you know, he's been a big supporter. Then I met Uncle Murder, and I met Mano, and I met Fifty. I met a bunch of rappers, man. So you know, as I get bigger, you know, they say, "Yo, man, I call them to come help me," and they come yeah. out, man. They come out, man. So it's a, it's a Brooklyn thing, man, and it's a New York thing. So I can't I can't get mad. Man. Speaking of which, how uh, would you rate, you know, as unbiased as you can be, yeah. uh, Jacob's performance? Was it subpar? Was it good? Was it sharp? Um, I didn't see every round, but we, I know Jacobs can do, always do better, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? Like, I okay. can do better, you know what I mean? So, uh, but he did what he had to do. Like I said, sometimes we're not going to have great nights all the time. Mm -hmm. I don't think it was Jacobs' pre uh, best performance, all right. yeah. and which is good, because I know, I know how good Jacob is. Yeah. So, we all have off nights, which is, which is all good. I had an off night, but we both got the win. We go back to the drawing board, and we fix. Like, this is boxing. You know, ain't nothing like it in the world. You know what I mean? It's not football. It's not soccer where someone's going to jump in and, and, yeah. and going for you. You know what I mean? So, you got to kind of, like, switch on a turn and try to adjust in it. You know what I mean? So, like I said, I, like, I had fun. I got some good rounds in. Um, and I stopped them earlier than anybody else. So. From all the other middleweights out there, you got Charlo and Andre up there now. Um, obviously, the you know you got the Triple G's and the Canelos. Who matches up the best with Jacob style-wise? Um, Just for an exciting fight. I think definitely Canelo. I think I think. Jacob okay. Is Paulie told me the same thing. Yeah, I think I think he's in the run for the big money fights. Um, you know, Canelo doesn't have any anybody else, and I know Canelo won a Triple G rematch. Triple G yeah. won the rematch, but Canelo. Yeah. Doesn't want every rematch right now. But uh, if anybody had to go beside Triple G, um, you to fight. I think you should fight Danny. Hold on, let me. You know Mel, I mean? Melvina. Good test. You know Come in, I mean? hold so, on. Uh, I think Danny Mike deserves it. Mike want to know where we at. You know what I mean? He, I think he actually beat Triple G. And they gave it to him. Bro. So, like I said, man, this is boxing. Style-wise, who do you think you match up best against with that uh, be a good, you know, maybe, you know, one more fight before a Joshua? Uh, Dylan White. Okay. Um, Wilson Ford. Brazil. 
Okay. Who else? Right for it. I don't know. There's a couple different guys. You know, but I, I'm. A, I'm Would you take the winner of Brazil, um, Charles Martin? Right on my left Yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Why not? Right. I'll bust him up. Yeah. You know what I mean? For sure. Okay. Um, but like I said, the main thing is going back to the home work. Okay. Fix what I did wrong in this fight. Right. Um, I think everybody, you know, AJ didn't look good in his last fight. The other for the person didn't want to fight. Yeah. I look too great, but I still got to stop it. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. So, like I said, it's boxing, man. Like I said, I had fun. And um, it was an awkward guy. This took me a real, took me a while to warm up, you know, going through a couple injuries. But um, like I said, man, I take a slap and win him a good loss anyway. Yeah. I mean, he's back, back to the drawing board, man. Yeah. It's boxing, baby. You're not going to have good nights every day. You know? So I'm happy. It is what it is, but back back to work. Good baby, can you give yourself a grade? A, B, what do you give yourself, man? I give myself a, a, a F. An F. An F. Whoa. Because um, it was just, just didn't start the right way I wanted to, you know. Um, the body didn't feel 100%. Uh, is that your arm, pal? Yeah, Left or right? Man, Which arm? Left arm was the, was, the, was the main thing that was hurting me. And um, just the footwork was just off tonight. You know, like it just it didn't come together where I wanted to. Um, it took a while for me to really just wake the body up and get it moving. Um, you know, going through some injuries in training. Actually, the training camp was, was rough. You I said camp was rough. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. You weren't able to say what it was. Yeah, man. Yeah, what had, was it, man? Um, what was hurting you? The elbow. Okay. And, um, I think the elbow was the main thing. We had a couple. I did some sprints, tweaked my, tweaked my ankle a little bit. But I think the elbow was the main factor because I couldn't do no weights, no push-ups. I couldn't do like anything that was strengthening wise. It was mostly just cardio, 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 cardio. And I think I kind of burned myself out towards the end. I do, I do like cardio for like an hour straight, the different kind of circuits. So I think I kind of pushed a little bit too much to just try to drop the weight. To kind of please the media a little bit to try to drop the weight. And like I know better, like I know my body, I know myself. So you know, I'm gonna go back. You to feel what better, ten pounds. Bigger? Yeah, yeah, actually, you felt, do. I mean, look at my fight. You, you guys can see yeah. my last fight. My performance was a lot better in my last fight right. compared to this fight. You know what I mean? Because I kind of got sucked in by the media. That I'm gonna drop the weight, forget. You know what I yeah. mean? But uh, like I said before, we're gonna tweak it. We're gonna go back and we're gonna fix it. It's boxing, baby. You gotta go back. And I adjusted into the fight, moved on him. Once I had his time down, I slipped a lot of shots, made him look a little stupid. But like I said, I got hit with a couple shots here and it didn't really bother me. But uh, the right hand was tagging you. Yeah. yeah. What did you do to adjust so you weren't um, getting hit by that? Yeah, I think I think the main thing was yeah. get, make 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 my. Yeah. We have to wrap it up because he has to go to the podium. Sure. That's for the powers that be, unfortunately. Yeah, yeah. So let mm -hmm. me go to the podium. He's going right now to the podium. So let me 